Hello everyone. In today's explain why series, we are going to understand why glucocorticoids does not bind to mineralocorticoid receptor. First of all, why we have to talk about glucocorticoids and mineralocorticoid receptor. The funniest fact is this mineralocorticoid receptors in general also they have high affinity for glucocorticoids. Their affinity for glucocorticoid is more than the mineralocorticoid itself. But still, this glucocorticoid does not produce these mineralocorticoid action in the target tissue. So let's try to understand what is the target tissue having, what is specificity of this target tissue, which is preventing the action of glucocorticoids acting on mineralocorticoid receptors. Let's try to understand the reason behind it. First thing is the kidneys and the other mineralocorticoid sensitive tissue. Whatever mineralocorticoid sensitive tissues in the present in the body, they have a specific enzyme. This enzyme is called as 11 hydroxy steroid dehydrogenase and the type 2 version. What is the purpose of this 11 HSD type 2? They convert the active form of corticosteroids to the derivatives. These derivatives cannot act on the mineralocorticoid receptors. For example, this will convert the cortisol to cortisone and finally they will form the 11 oxy derivatives of glucocorticoids. This 11 oxy derivatives of glucocorticoids cannot act on the mineralocorticoid receptors. Normally, this cortisol and cortisol can act on the mineralocorticoid receptors, but they are converted into their derivatives so that they don't act on the mineralocorticoid receptors and cause, cause the mineralocorticoid effect. If this enzyme is not there, what will happen is there is huge availability of glucocorticoids in the blood and all this tissue will start to act so much of mineralocorticoid action which can be severely deleterious to the patient. I hope it's clear. Thank you for watching the video. Subscribe to the channel for more such content. Thank you so much.